I've since talked to Twilio um, support and they were completely unhelpful. So I just said, look, could you please close my account? I'm going to be uninstalling Twilio Quest and in its place, um, we are going to be... Let's do that. And in this place, we're going to be doing Aeons of Sand, the trail. So it's, it's going to be times. Not a good sign. If I did this 150 times, I think that um, my brain would melt. Because the the, uh, the movement in this game is just so slow. We've, we've, we've activated like uh, a few things here. I'm very interested in what um, Aeon of Sand is going to look like on stream. And I hope you will enjoy it. It looked, it looked decent, it looked uh, very unique. I hadn't done certain things, triggered certain cutscenes or story trees, I don't know. It's all a learning experience, isn't it? I'm gonna go back in here and see if I can show sure regret. He only wakes up at night. I just don't know where to click what to do, you know? Whoops. 
Oh, whoops. Oh, whoopsie, big whoopsie. Okay, that's probably not good. So, the engine was buggered, but now the core's buggered. Pod doors released. One tank's remaining. ship's gonna blow up. Nine hundred and twenty-eight. So there must have been something going on, but that's um zero point nine percent of the stream. Eh, I'll take that. I'll take those odds. few more of them up. Okay, I'm on board. I'll do it. I'm 
I'll make no apologies for my, my physical condition. Okay. <clears throat> I think, yeah, let's go um, this way first. If I remember correctly, there's a thing here. Once we light up um, those three and return to the, uh, the pre statue area, possibly the ending, wouldn't that be good? Come on, come on, move, move, move your ass. Primordia was a trip, huh? As, as um, I mean. The puzzles are meant to be difficult, yeah, and we're doing it completely blind. Uh, I like it. I like it a lot. I was a bit apprehensive about it because of its age and it being a point-click adventure, but I like what it was. Uh, what was happening? All right. That should be all of them, yeah. We've got the green, and then we've got the red, and now we've got the blue. That should be uh, all of them, so we should go back. Yes. Yes, I think we shall. Like I said, there seems to be a lot of busy work. There's not a lot of meat on the, uh, the bones of this one. I, I would be interested more if it's like showing me some more ideas, some more narratives. Ah, oh, that's probably because we're getting closer to the end, hopefully. The oxygen must be getting low. I wonder if this character will collapse. Lapse the party, your boy. Get in there.
Guess I became a robot, okay. Oh, shit. Do I want to start over? Hmm. I'm gonna have a little look online to see if there are multiple endings to this game. Because if I got like bad ending. Is it not going to... Like, finding um, information on this game is uh, difficult enough as it is. Maybe if I put in more head. Spooky, isn't it? So spooky. No, this is not... This is not what we want. Okay, I found the Steam page. <laughs> Re reviews mostly negative. Wow. So I don't care what people think of it, I just want to see if there's like... Um, community Hub on Steam? Discussions, that's probably where we want to get. Uh, ending discussion. Okay. Just wanted to check if everyone got the same ending or if there are multiple ones. Mine, Astro Girl turns into a giant robot. You click, she wakes up, game over. Any variants from this? Okay, so in the discussion, this guy says, um, The first day is just to orientate yourself. The first night shows that the temple, the temples light up, but strangely there is a dead golem blocking the way. The second day you see a golem drown itself, and your life support explodes. The second night you become one, so you survive, quote-unquote. So you will go through your existence as one of those golems, until you can no longer bear it, and like your forebearers before you, you will either live out your own life, walking around, seeing other people crash, or you'll also kill yourself by drowning, falling off a cliff, or jumping off the top of a finger. Okay. Yeah, I, I really do think that that is the one and only uh, game ending. I mean, <laughs> it is what it is, right? Um, you become stranded, it's this new planet, some stuff happened, and then you turn into a golem. No, the end. <laughs> but that's why I decided to do this as a one-shot. Yeah, I can't see any other stuff. Let me see, let me see. 
alternative endings. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, I think that's it. I really do think that's it. And if I am wrong, we will revisit it on stream at a different time. Do I want to start over? No. Just like that. Yeah, so if you pressed yes, it would, it would start over the game from the very beginning. Oh. So, um, my overall impression of that game... Um, I mean, it's a game, I guess. <laughs> um, I mean, we all got to start somewhere, right? And uh, the music at times was pretty cool. Um, there were parts of it was like, oh, like, like it did ev evoke something. Do I think it's really that deep of a game, though? Um, no. Glad I finished it. Seemingly have finished it. I believe I have finished it. Um, yeah. Yeah. 